want to some wang. Welcome back. One fucking second, please. Right. Welcome back to Let's Play Shadow Warrior. My wang stands ready. This is Execute. Welcome to the second and last secret level of the main game. This is Auto Mall. <laughs> Start by crawling over this way for some sticky bombs. Also, you get a bunch of fucking drops from the enemies who are near the barrels. This level's called Auto Mall because, you know, that. There's a whole bunch of really badly fucking designed cars, but whatever. Just put that down to the graphical limitations of the time. If you begin by throwing a sticky bomb down there, a portal medikit will pop up for you, so be sure to grab it. Now then, we have a yellow key door here, we obviously don't have because we just fucking started. There's also a red one down there. We're not going to go in either of these directions, we're going to go to the cafeteria from where we'll be able to pick the blue key card. Heads up, because there are a bunch of shitheads in here. Two basic ninjas who are going to be annoying as hell from behind the counters, and one red ninja. So I can blow this clown the fuck up. Well, that works. And if you destroy that bin in the middle, you uh, get a missile launcher. Now there's a couple of things to be gotten from uh, this Duke Burger area. Come back here for an Uzi. <laughs> you actually get a second Uzi from behind this counter, as well as some grenades and a fortune cookie. Ah, better than acupuncture. Fortune say, sorry, you know when this involves. Oh well, shit happens. Hey, you see the blue key card is right here. Let's pick it up. Around this corner, but heads up. If you're a bit too quick going around there, they'll shoot. They'll try to shoot you and hit the barrel, and you'll all fucking die. And that would be a bit fucking tragic, don't you think? Such a waste of fucking ammo trying to kill these guys with the Uzis, but it's alright, you can get some of them back here. Now this is, that, that yellow key door leads to the same one from before, just from the other entrance. We'd like to get into that vent, because there's something nice that we can get up there. Although obviously we can't fucking jump that high. So how are we going to get up there? We're going to use the vending machine. Start by pressing this phone that's flickering. It'll open up an ancient Chinese cigarette with a gas bomb. Ancient Chinese secret. And some missiles. And that also moves the vending machine, so now you can jump on it and make a sort of fucked up jump into the vent. This is not a secret, but it's worth it to come in here because you'll get a guardian head for your trouble. Now, this big fucking metal door can be opened, so do so. You're looking at the uh, main hub of this level. This place has four exits, the one we just came from, one that requires the blue key, which we have, one that requires the green key, which leads to the exit, and one that leads to the door with the red key. Be sure to uh, hop in the back of this vehicle. Because there's an Uzi up for grabs, and more importantly, a railgun. <laughs> now that we have this railgun, we want to proceed, so let's find that door that needs it. Here it is. This will lead us to the uh, showroom. So open it up. Find the dickhead with the grenades. If you missed the uh, earlier missile launch, you can get one from this little office room here. And we're going to take this, but there's also an ancient Chinese cigarette in this room. I will come back for it, though. Because it actually has a portable medikit, and I haven't really put mine to use yet. Chuck your gas bomb around here, because there's an Imba prick. In fact, I think there's two Imba pricks. Oh, that's one down. Oh, and you dropped a gas bomb. How nice. Have a second. It's not very often I get to double gas. I can't believe that fuckhead made it through. Alright, that way we'll lead to the uh, red key card, but first let's go behind this uh, single vehicle here. If you open to the water, there are a couple of baby rippers up here, but uh, this is an ancient Chinese cigarette. Wang will declare that when you jump out of the water. From back here, you can get a few uh, nice items. Go ahead and burn all your Uzi ammo, because you can get it back from in here. Ancient Chinese cigarette. You'll also get a suit of Kevlar. Bunch of Uzi ammo and flash bomb, okay. What's still a Oh yeah, that's right. A coolie spawns when you uh, get that secret, so just rem remember that he's there. That's a very obvious secret in front of us, but I'm not gonna open it just yet because from the back of this fucking vehicle, you can get some sticky bombs. Now let's open it. Be ashamed to waste a missile on that. And 
Ancient Chinese secret. That's odd. I could have sworn it was a fucking nuke here. Weird. Anyway, you can also open this door for a uh, smoke bomb. There's another ancient Chinese cigarette. Ancient Chinese secret. And now there's only one way left to go, so let's follow the uh, ramp to the upstairs area. You'll find one vehicle with the riot gun and the red K on it, so go ahead and grab both those things. And you'll also see a chick over there. Now just a heads up, this chick doesn't really think much of you. Go ahead and talk to her and you'll uh you'll see exactly what I mean. You got something with a bigger backseat? Hmm? American high school. You only date Americans. Okay, fair enough. Hey, I'm married to American. I ain't gonna fucking front. Anyway, make your way back. Now, heads up though. Get a strong weapon ready because two fat cunts have spawned out here. I absolutely hate it when they fucking set my wang on fire. I won't lie. It is good day to die. Now I'm going to tell you a little secret about these guys. It's actually best to use the uh, right gun on them. You wouldn't think, but it is. I'll show you exactly why. Look how fast that fucking killed him. I don't know why the riot gun's so good against them, but it just ah, is. Better than acupuncture. Anyway, that ancient Chinese cigarette in here. Go ahead and use the computer. It'll open that. Uh, it'll lower that locker, and you can just crawl in there for some uh, cow chops and the health thing. Ancient thanks. Chinese cigarette. So now that we have the red key, we can make some progress. What the hell? I, I don't remember this fortune cookie being here. Oh well. Fortune say your accent attracts many chicks. Yeah, I know. Um. Okay, the red key. It's this way. Watch out though, because there's uh, reinforcements. I'm actually kind of bummed out. I, I should have had a nuke by this point. I don't know where the fuck it went. Maybe it'll show up in the bonus run. I don't fucking know. Anyway, let's open this sucker up. Heads up, because there's two dickheads in here. Just go ahead and gun them the fuck down and look through the window. You'll see a bunch of rippers in there. Now, what you want to do is want to open oh, this thing I'm here by pressing pressing the light switch and that will open the little thing here and you can get the grenade launcher from here and this grenade launcher is going to be like your go-to way to kill the rippers you may have noticed that there was a missile in that garage well you can just bounce grenades off that back wall to reach that missile and blow the rippers the fuck up should remove the glass first just in case It was nice of one of them to drop a uh, ripper heart for me. Anyway, from in here you can get some more health if you need it, and a uh, set of nitrogen goggles. There's more rippers up the top, so just remember that they're there. Usually there's two, I don't know why there's only one. Oh well. I'll be taking my second ripper heart. There's also a uh, gas bomb up here, and some rail rods. And behind the blue car there's also a uh, box of sticky bombs? Yeah, sticky bombs. Once you finish looting the garage, jump down. Uh, only one of these doors works, so open it up. Blow the barrels the fuck up however the hell you want, because we need to progress this way. Uh, once the barrels are gone, because the enemies are too stupid and fucking stay near them and they'll be killed in the process, go ahead and jump in this dumpster and then up to the wall. You can get a set of armor here. More importantly though, you see the uh, window here? You can jump through these. Doesn't matter which one, but uh, I'll just demonstrate you can break the glass. Now, careful when you jump through, because there's going to be a ripper in here. Dick. Fucking hell, it's Ripper Heart Central. Anyway, here's the exit of the level, but uh, we can't access that yet. We'll need the green key. We haven't got that. Before we can get that, though, we're going to get the yellow key. I like big weapons. So many fucking Ripper Hearts. I guess they're compensating for that nuke. Anyway, the yellow key card is here. Be sure to bust open this vent. It's not a secret, but another fucking Ripper Heart up for grabs in here. I got four fucking Ripper Hearts. That's awesome. It's a shame I gotta ditch all my fucking weapons when I leave this level. Ah well. Now that we have the yellow key card, our next destination is going to be... Where the fuck? There it is. E either side works, just take your pick. We're just gonna open it for this one. Mind the guardians in here. You look like a stupid. Of course, I got so many fucking ripper hearts, I might as well. Touch wangs. Be sure to bust this open. You can jump up here for a uh, right gun. Kawabunga. Now then, the green key card is here and we're going to need this to finish the level, so let's take it. Collecting that will spawn some ember bricks outside though, so just remember that they're there. Explode this computer. 
if you do this, you'll get a uh, heat seeker card for your trouble. And this will just lead us outside. In fact, this leads back to the start of the level. Now then, I gotta fight the fucking Imba Bricks. That's always fun. Uh, how do I want to fucking approach this? Fuck it, just charge them. There's one. There's the other. Interesting, they usually take more than one fucking rocket to kill. Let me just quickly double check that that... Uh, yeah, I, I could have sworn it came out of the bin that was here, but apparently not, because... There's no fucking nuke. Well, if you had a nuke, you'd want to use it at, at the next bit, but since I don't, I'll just compensate with a fucking Ripper Heart, I suppose. A whole bunch of shit spawned in here. And when I say a whole bunch of shit, I'm not kidding. Sumos, Rippers... Possibly Imba Pricks, I can't remember. Fucking set my wagon on fire, you fat shit. Good heavens, they're just fucking throwing ripper hearts at me, aren't they? I am the Shadow Warrior. Well, grats to me for totally forgetting that I had a fucking smoke bomb to use. Alright, touch wangs. What's left? A couple more things. This is not tournament. This is a warrior. God, I was half expecting another fucking ripper heart. Alright. Stop walking through the gas. My fucking wang is retarded. Anyway, we got the green key. We don't actually need to unlock this though. We've already done one and that just does all of them for some reason. And that's it. That's the second circuit level done. Silly level. I'm fucking annoyed. I wanted my nuke. Anyway, we got all the secrets. Missed four it is, but ah, what the fuck ever. Alright, thank you very much for watching. This has been Execute. Take care. Stay safe. And of course, I'm gonna see if that fucking nuke is there in the bonus run. Fuck you. Oh, better zip fly. than acupuncture.
Be women! 